Congress is coming back for a jam-packed session. You have XM, budget, big kind of controversial issues that could be um, have some landmines there. So XM has expired, and you're going to see Democrats and both the Senate and the House really pushing for renewal on that front. Budget, Democrats in the Senate are really blocking those budget bills from going forward, which could put us at a risk for a shutdown next fall. You also have these Iranian nuclear talks happening. Now they might get, uh, clinch a deal over uh, in Europe. Who knows? That's still a question mark, but if it comes back, that's going to be an explosive issue in Congress. And then, of course, you also have the ongoing issues over the Highway Trust Fund, which right. is set to expire at the end of July, and there's a debate over whether to do a short-term or a long-term extension. Right, and it's really starting to look more like it's going to be a, a series of potential short-term extensions, mm -hmm. something that, you know, the chairman, Mr. Schuster, really didn't want to have to right. do. But, you know, last week he had to end up pulling his FAA bill, so another kind of uh, hit for kind of the Transportation Committee. But one of the things that there's been a lot of talk of is potentially taking on XM to one of the short-term extensions, which could kind of put together some interesting odd bedfellows. Absolutely, but if they do that, you're going to have a huge issue with your House conservatives who absolutely are opposed to XM, which then could put the Highway Trust Fund at risk, and there's a lot of issues, a lot of explosive, and with just three weeks before they go on August recess, the stakes couldn't be higher.